Welcome to Rem TV and welcome back to my Madden NFL Connected franchise of the Denver Broncos. This is episode 9. So if you guys aren't caught up, look look for a playlist in the channel. And if you're new, subscribe and click that notification bell to be basically told whenever we come out with a new video. And if you like what you see, click that thumbs up button. I'm trying to get at least 3 to 5 likes for this video. And leave any comments below. And here we are for this week 9 match against the 5 and 3 Texans. Excuse me, we're going to be playing in Denver. Before we get started, we still have a few injuries left that we need to, that we need to just, uh, I guess, talk about. We we have um, Shelby Harris and Damian Williams coming back very very soon, um, so it should add a little more depth in my uh, offense. But we're still trying to find our way, man. Our offense is really not that good. Uh, defensively, I mean, we are hit or most of the time hit, but there's some misses there. Um, but we just need to get offense going, man. It's going to be tough, especially with J.J. Watt there and the rest of the Texans. Uh, we need to really improve and really just try to just grind it out. Grind it out, grind it out, grind it out. And uh, hoping for the best against the, the, the pretty decent Texans. Again, look, look, look at the stat difference here within J.J. Watt and Derek Wolf. Even DeAndre Hopkins, Emmanuel Sanders. Emmanuel Sanders is by far not a scrub, but look at look at the overall uh, comparison between all these all these players. We need to get better. We need to play better. We need to play more crisp. And yeah, the only guy that we really have an advantage of is Von Miller. Uh, so yeah. What the, what the hell? I don't care who the hell that was, really? That, 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 oh my gosh, that's ridiculous. That's field goal for Houston. Uh, we gotta get offense together, man. Can't seem to pass against them. Oh! Did I get the ball back? I got the ball back! From a hit stick fumble! Let's go! Replay, please! So he's about to get the ball, fumble. I mean, he's about to get the uh, punt. Knocked it out for the ball. Oh, I got sacked. Damn it. Now we gotta settle for it. We literally moved. Oh shit, two yards. And I, I mistimed it. I missed. Damn it, what the f Keep that. Let's go. Let's go. Whoop. Keep going, keep going. Ah, that's an interception by Brock Sr. I knew that was mine. Sutton with a catch for the first. All right, we're moving here. We're moving. Really? There you go. Finally, field goal. Should be 6 nothing to be honest. But I'll take the field goal here and a tie game. First place in their division. Looking good. Looking to be a threat come January. And let's think about what every team has in their goals. Oh, my gosh. Come on. Oh my gosh. Really? Who's going to give a touchdown just like that? Freaking amazing. Safety. No? At the one yard line? Oh my gosh, man. This is a quarterback. The ball gets away from him. Everyone else is trying to execute what they're supposed to do on offense. They're usually looking in the other direction. Ooh, really? Moved away from him. In this case, they'll have to punt here because they're gifted with terrific field position. I don't even want to think about the idea that they would end up punting starting with this type of field position. Neither do they. Great starting spot. Great opportunity to run your full playbook. They want to take a shot here. Give me that ball back. The Bradley will be with the interception, but we need to score. 
There's no there's no offense for us. Almost as if the first one that he threw, he couldn't shake, couldn't get it out of his head. He ends up throwing a second one as a result. Oof. There you go. Good run. A Freeman. Good blocking, good everything, man. That's what I need. Good catch by Cortland Sutton. And Paradis gets injured. I don't know what that is, but I'm not gonna let it worry me. Good catch. There you go. We'll keep moving. There you go. There you go. Touchdown! That's a pass to Hireman for the touchdown. We're gonna, we're gonna try to tie it up right before the end of the half. The field goal attempt. Oop. And there's a sack. There's a sack by Derek Wolf in the backfield. That is a loss of eight. Give that ball. That's another interception by the Broncos. That's Darian Stewart this time with the interception. He's trying to make it for that touchdown he gave up. That is an INT for the Broncos. Oof! Shook him out of his shoes for a first. There is Booker again. With another first. Just one conversion and eight tries. Not good. This will be third and six. From midfield, here's Keenum. There you go. There you go. Hireman passed a little late, but got the first down anyway. I'm okay with it. Ooh. Oh, keep going. Booker is running right now, man. He is he is going against this uh Texans defense. Come on. Oh, Hyman had it. He dropped it. Mm. All right, so we'll settle for a field goal. I'm okay with it. We 13-10. Broncos with about nine minutes left. We just got to play really good defense. Really good defense. Oh, shoot. Oh my gosh. Darian, what kind of coverage is that? It's a 51 yard bomb. Oh my gosh. Again, Darian's still with a blown coverage. Oh my gosh. Now they're up 17 13. Eight minutes left. Because they were well within range of scoring a touchdown. We'll see if they can do better now. Good catch. Good catch. By Demarius Thomas. For the first. Maybe we can answer back really quick. Who knows? You could have kicked that one through. I don't know about that. That is a first down by. Sanders this time. All right. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Come on, keep going. I got the first. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Woo. Thought I got stuff there, but apparently not. I think he looks at it as I can do it. So it's not that big of a deal to me. And I'm going to keep firing. No. Oh. Oh. Fuck! Really? That sucks. 
Oh, gave up the interception at the very end. He had his blown coverages, man. Can't believe it. Darian Stewart, who I'm usually depending on, gave up two big touchdowns. Two big, two big touchdowns. It might have been the same play. Look at this. Deshaun Watson was 8 for 17. 246 yards. Three interceptions, two touchdowns. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, man. Ugh, it just it just angers me a little bit because it shouldn't have happened. Darren Stewart should have never blown that. Not happy about it, man. Not happy about it at all. Another loss. Getting advanced. On the injury, of course. Web to Paredes. So you have a dislocated ankle out for eight weeks. Cool. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, Damian Williams, I'm gonna have you rest. Devontae Booker, Devontae Booker is Booker is rushing pretty decently right now, and you know I don't want to risk you getting injured again. So, um, yeah, I <sighs> just a little, little, a little ticked off. Um, but we're gonna try to advance here, advance the next game against the Chargers. And Damian Williams should be back. Should be. Uh, Brendan Langley, cornerback, is available for an upgrade. Cool. Um, Alright. So you upgrade a bunch of stuff here. And is anybody else available for an upgrade? No. Okay. So take a look at the injuries again. And we are we have everybody back actually. I mean, what's name should be back? Um, Damian Williams. So that should be interesting. Devontae Booker was actually rushing pretty well, um, but we ended up also losing Paredes out for eight weeks. So down the middle is gonna be pretty weak, but hopefully we can we can do something here. Um, so I'm gonna wrap it up here. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, episode of my. Uh, I'm Madden Connected Franchise with the Denver Broncos. Uh, click the like button if you like what you see. Leave it in the comments below. Hope you guys have a great day. Take it easy and.